you both look perfect together. Thank you, Thanks, sir. Dawson? Sir? Are you ready to marry my daughter? <sighs> yes, sir. I love her and I can't wait to make her my wife. You can't wait. What, what I mean is, I can't wait for your approval. Really? Yes, sir. Then you have to wait. You have to wait for that approval. And you only come in three months' time. Hmm? Three months? Yes. Three months of training. Uh, what, what training, sir? Listen, as you know, she's my only daughter. And any man that must marry her must come live with us in this house for at least three months so I can teach him how to love and take care of my daughter. Is your father joking or is he for real? I don't know. You can't tell me you don't know. It sounded like something he's been planning all along. He's mentioned it once during one of my birthday parties and he never mentioned it again after the occasion, so I wouldn't know. That means he's serious. And what if he is? Are you joking? Wait, how can I move into your house? Does that make sense? But there's, there's no big deal in it, really. If you really love me, you do it. It's a big deal, babe. It's a very big deal. How can I move into your house for three months? So, what are you going to do? Thinking you are here with me. You have caused me pain. Mm. The groom is here. <laughs> Good evening, Mom. Good evening. How are you? How did it go? Did her father like you? What is it? What happened? Did something wrong happen? Um, nothing happened. Uh, he didn't say anything. Just like that? Just like that. Is it because you went alone? Oh my God. If I had known, I would have accompanied you. Eh? Hey. This is not a good sign at all. It's not. What do we do now? I don't know. Ah. <sighs> Dad, please now. Please don't insist for him to move in with us. He really loves me. I know. You have said that over a thousand times. Dad, please now. Just let us be, please. Let you be? Did he let you be with a young man of this generation? <laughs> Married today, divorced tomorrow? Huh? Uh, no. No, no, no. If you don't want me to get married, just say so, because I don't think there's any man on earth that will accept this condition of yours. Well, I would rather let you grow old in my house than to send you on a suicide mission. Listen, young men of this day cannot be trusted. Look, I must investigate that young man before I give you out in marriage. That is going to destroy my relationship. Mm. Yes. If he truly loves you, 
he will do anything to have you. He truly loves me. Oh, another affirmation. Oh, to me, repetition. <sighs> oh, young lady, go and get me a glass of water. I'm thirsty. You have made me talk for too long. Will you go and get a glass of water or will you rather let your father die of thirst? Oh. Love. You won't believe my dad brought it up again. I'm telling you, I just think he doesn't want me to get married. So why will he be insisting for Godson to come live here with us? Where on earth will he find that kind of man that will do it? He doesn't know anything. I think he just wants me to be here in this stupid house. He will not do it. Remember that was how I lost my last relationship. I don't want to lose Godson. Before you know what's up now, he will stop taking my calls. Would you think you would do it? I'm just, I'm worried. I'm, I'm, I'm. Okay, thank you. Talk to you later. What is the problem? I'm fine, that's it. What did he say? Um, the truth is, he actually responded. Um, he said that if I want to marry his daughter, I need to move into his house for three months for him to train me on how to love and take care of his daughter. <laughs> what? Come, come, come. Was he drunk when he told you that? No, he wasn't. Are you sure? That is over my dead body. Nobody in our lineage ever did that. And you will not be the first to do it. No, it's unacceptable. I say no to that. There are so many fishes in the ocean. You can get a beautiful, well-read and articulate girl from a rich home to get married to. Forget her. Forget her father. In fact, let him go and marry his daughter. Hmm? Auntie, the only fish I want is this. And the fish is about to drown you. Look, Auntie, I don't think it's such a big deal. Uh, I feel like I should just do it. Do it. To go and become their slave, right? All because you want to get married to Calisto. Are you normal? Your head they shake. Something they do you. Hmm. Oh, sad. Very sad. No. I think you have to have a rethink of what your decision is. That's just the truth. Hmm. Come and leave. Three months just because you need a, 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 to get married to his daughter. Ah, it's, it's really pathetic. Kawaru, it has never happened in our lineage. Never. Please, please, please. I don't want to hear that. Don't you ever repeat that. You won't do that. Never.
how are you today? I'm fine. What's happening with Gossen? When is he moving in? He hasn't said anything. Why? Because he has not said anything. He's always avoiding the topic. Oh, I see. But Daddy, why won't you just allow us to get married like a normal human being, like every other person? No. I made my reason clear to you. Okay? You need to obey my wish. But your wish is unacceptable. It's not favorable to us. To so anyone who hears it. I told you before, my dear. If he refuses to move in, then get yourself another man. Ghost is the only one I love. Okay. Uh, where? I'm sorry, it's not my fault. It's what your generation is turning into that I fear. I need to protect you, my daughter. Now, if you cannot get your man to do what I want, you need to look elsewhere. is ringing and he's not picking. Hi. Hi. Where can he be now? What's happening? God, please save my child. It's so late and I can't find him. He's not even picking his call. Father, please save my son. Please save him. Ah, let me try him again. Hey, baby. I'm fine, and you? <sighs> I miss you more. You're also quiet. Your dad asked after you. You know, he still had the months about it. And he's even suggesting I go find someone else. Yeah. He understands I want to be with you, but he's not changing his mind on what he told you. Well, babe, can you just do it? I don't think three months is such a long time. Before you know what's up, it's over. So what do we do? I don't think it'll work because I've tried everything I know. All the skills, all the whining, none worked. Okay. You want to come over here? Okay. Bye. Morning. Good morning. How are you today? I'm, I'm good, and you? Very well. Thank you. Yes, a nice hair. Thank you. <laughs> so we could definitely be a good one with a stunning look. Austin, I need the file for the clearance of goods coming in from China today. Okay, I was just trying to. You know, send it to my office, okay? I'll be waiting. I need it right now. Okay. What kind of culture do you people have? How can your father ask my son to come and stay in his house for three months so that he can ascertain if my son is the right man for you or not? I mean, where is that done? So called for. I understand your anger, ma. I'm sorry. No, you don't. I'm not angry. 
But what I'm just saying is, no, capital, no. It's an insult. What would I tell his uncles? Mama, you don't need to tell them. Ma. And what about if something happens to him while he stays in your house? Nothing will happen to him. Ma. I say a big amen to that. But my answer is no. Capital, no. It's unacceptable. But, but Ma, I mean, Jacob in the Bible served his father-in-law for seven years. I don't think it's a big deal. <laughs> Jacob. <laughs> You're talking about Jacob. Listen, my son is not Jacob. He is God's son, Nande. Eh? So he will not be like Jacob that sat years and then added more. Ne? I said no. My son will not do that. In fact, the reverse should be the case. You are the one that's supposed to come and stay in my house. So that I can ascertain if you are the right woman for him or not. And not the other way around, the way your father is trying to place it. Ma, I, I know he, he's just acting out of tradition. It's a decision he made. What tradition is that? That is not African tradition that a man should go to his girlfriend's house and stay with his father-in-law so that he can see if he is a right suitor or not. That is nonsense. It's not Africa tradition. Your father just invented that. Okay, ma. I'm sorry, ma. Well, go back and tell your father that I said no. It will not happen. Okay, ma. Thank you, ma. I'm sorry, ma. Unacceptable. Oh, she's back. Hi. Hi. You're welcome, my adorable daughter. Dad, good evening. Lovely. <laughs> I moved in. That's what's going on. You're kidding. No. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, mm, how was your day? Amazing. Was... I see. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um... Take me. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, oh, great. No, it's okay. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, my, my bag's already upstairs. Yeah. What was that? Eh. <clears throat> no, sir. Yeah. I'm a perfect gentleman, sir. <laughs> really? <laughs> <laughs> mm. Look, a young man with blood 
pump it through his vein to mm. not be innocent. Hmm? Hey, 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 young man, keep your hand where I can see them, okay? Very good. Please, uh, wait, 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 let me just take one. But you know this is not easy. <laughs> <laughs> I did not ask you to move in here so you could impregnate my daughter right under my roof. I'm sorry, sir. Listen carefully. You have no business with her until you duly complete your three months training. I'm just playing, sir. I'm just trying to catch up. He is supposed to catch up with me and not with you. I will say this first and the last time. Any meandering will cost you extra time in this house. Mm -hmm. Sorry, sir. Now go to your room. Of course. And you, stop jumping at him like one to no to no. You too, go to your room. Just calm down. I think he knows what he's doing. You've been singing his song for so long. What exactly is he doing? Trust him. Besides, he's your father. And that makes him the alpha and omega of my life. <laughs> Maybe you should be you should be happy that you have a father who wants to direct your life in a proper base. <sighs> Not really base. A <laughs> <Our> foundation. <laughs> oh, it doesn't make sense. Really, it doesn't make sense. Ali. Snicked into my daughter's room. Huh? He wants to impregnate my daughter. Hey, this boy wants to impregnate my daughter. Oh, he wants to impregnate my daughter. This boy. Good morning, Daddy. Good morning. Sir. So I'm riding with him. You don't have to worry. No. No and no. That is forbidden here. What do you mean that is forbidden here? He is not here for you both to be involved in some kind of romantic moment. Yes, sir. What do you mean by yes, sir? 
is right. There's time for everything. I think you should ride with him. Very good. Um, um, Gossie? Yes, sir. The driver will drive you henceforth. Um, sir, I don't think that's necessary. I am the chief commander here. Hmm? Of course. What can you say, sir? He's on his way, okay? And you? Let's go. Follow me. Good day, Chief. How are you, Austin? I'm fine, sir. I'm fine. Hey, and uh, where are you up to? Um, heading to the bank. Bank? Yes, sir. Uh, why are you going alone? What about my daughter, Kalista? She's not around. You're sure she's not in the office? Yes, she's not around. Um, okay. Yeah. All right, I'll show you return on time. Right. Thank you, sir. Okay. Kalista. So you sneaked out of the office to go home to meet that boy. So you arranged to meet in my absence under my roof. Oh. Okay. Why are you just coming now? Um, I was at work. At work? I called you several last night. You didn't pick. Sorry, I was busy. Busy? That late? Bank work for that matter. You don't have to close late. What happened? Auntie, I had a lot of work on my desk and I had to stay up all night to finish it. But that's not enough for you not to pick your calls. At least you should have the infantry of calling me and telling me what is the situation. Oh, I sent you a WhatsApp message. But you know I don't go online all the time. I didn't even see it. Because it demands you call me. Sorry, Auntie, but that was the quickest and easiest way for me to communicate with you. <laughs> it's okay. So... How are you? I'm okay. I'm fine. I'm just stressed tired. Out. A little tired, but I'm fine. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, I think I have to get you something to eat, okay? Okay. Thank you. Um, right. I'll just freshen up. Um, Auntie? Yes. I'll be traveling to Port Harcourt this evening for work. Port Harcourt? Yes. On an official assignment. How long are you going to stay? Uh, Two to three weeks, thereabout. Wow. Yeah. Ah. Please, you have to be very careful. Mm? Mm -hmm. Do you want me to help you in packing? No, 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 no. I already have everything I need. <laughs> oh, really? Yes, ma'am. It's all right. Yeah. So just go and do that while I prepare something for you to eat, okay? Thank you. All right. Yeah. It's okay. <sighs> ah.
Uh, you're, you're, you're home? Yes, sir. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, Are you okay? <laughs> yes. Um, Kalisa. Yes, sir. Since uh, Justin moved in here, your movement has suddenly become shady. I don't like it. Oh. Uh, I'm not comfortable with it. I only just go home from work so I can cook. There's nothing in the house to eat. Uh -huh. Yes, sir. Uh, uh, by the way, where is he? He's not back from work. Um, oh, okay. Um, get me a cup of water to drink. Okay, Dad. You going to bed? Oh no! How can I go to bed when you both are still downstairs here? Yeah? Well, I mean, we only are just watching TV, the news, and we can take care of ourselves. Is anything wrong if I spend some time with you? Huh? No, no, Sorry. nothing. It's quite late. Mm. You need to get some rest. Uh, yes, <laughs> but don't worry about me. I'm fine. <laughs> I just want to have a good evening with two of you. <laughs> Oh, yo, the news. Yeah. <laughs> A nice one. Oh. He was going to Port Harcourt on official duty and yet he moved all his valuables from the closet and left just little things there. No, something is not right. Something is not right. Yes, I'm going to get to the root of this. I will get to the root of this. Baby. Mm -hmm. I miss you. I miss you too, man. <laughs> Let's go on a date tomorrow. Mm, a date? Uh -huh. Lunch or dinner? Whichever. I think lunch is a, is a good idea because hmm, dad won't let us out of his sight. I know, right? Mm -hmm. I know. <sighs> but this is how we're going to continue. Like, we need to find a solution. What can we possibly do? I think we need to find him a distraction. What kind of distraction would you mean by that? Maybe we should hook him up with someone. What do you mean by that? Let's find him a babe. <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious. You remember my dad a babe? Yeah. Never. No, 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 baby, he needs the distraction. Honestly. 
That man will have a cardiac arrest one day. Okay. I, I mean, I wish him well, of course, but I just think that we need to find him a distraction. Hmm. Hmm? <laughs> so where do we get the baby from? Club? Street? I can't stand a street girl being with my dad. It has to be a random babe. I'll be on the lookout. <laughs> no, yeah, okay. no, I mean it's. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny, Wait, I think I I know someone that can do this job. Really? Who? That's what she will agree to. Who? Wow, that's, that's not a bad idea. Mm. At least with her, we're sure she'll get the job done. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> your daddy's about to have a baby. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Break him now! Now you got the gate. Now, now break him. Your head don't correct. I came here to see Kalista. Open this gate for me. I told you to open this gate. Open it. 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 Open this gate, I want to see my son! Yes. Then I want to see him! Open this gate! Open this gate! Open! I want to see my son! Who came out? Open it! Open. Open. Yes! Auntie, please come. Nothing. What are you doing here? You told me you are going to Portacot. Is this the Portacot you went to? Eh? Auntie, Auntie, just come. Go and break up this and let's get out of this place. Okay, Auntie, you need to calm down, okay? Calm down for what? If you don't close your mouth, I'm going to give you my backhand. Auntie. Go upstairs now and call your father. Tell him to come down here. I want to see. Auntie. He's staying in bed, ma. I, I'll go call him. You need to calm down. <laughs> I said, go and tell your father that I, Neka, Gossus, Auntie, wants to see him. Bring him down here because I want to give him my peace of mind. Auntie. Okay, I will, but you need to calm down. Auntie, you need to stop raising your voice. I said, don't say that to me again. Okay, ma. Auntie, 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 you... Let us go before I drag you like a pig up! Let's stop, go! Stop you embarrassing I'm, I'm going to embarrass you if you don't go! Auntie, let's go! Now explain everything to you, please come I down. don't want to listen. I said let us Auntie, go! Auntie, Auntie, Auntie... No! Auntie, you, Auntie you're bad! No! Telling you about everything that happened. I said his auntie came here to bundle him away like a child. So he has gone home? Yes. So what did your daddy do about this? He was sleeping. I didn't hear it. Wow. So what will you do next? I don't know. Dear. Everything was just so weird. <sighs> huh. The aunt would have allowed him now since he has started this journey. We even have a bigger problem, Seraf. You know, the few days he spent here was very disturbing. It was dramatic. My dad will not allow us to have a moment of peace. He was just monitoring every of our moves. Yeah, you said that earlier. So, gosh. Please, I need your help. My help? How? Okay, so, I... I need you to kind of, I just need some kind of distraction for my dad so that he would allow Gus and I, you know, have some time for ourselves. You know, something to distract him. How is that even possible? So that's where you're coming, actually. So I, what, I don't even know how to say this, but I, I, can you, act, can you just be his girlfriend? <laughs> you, you're kidding me, right? I'm not kidding, I'm serious. <laughs> you want me to date your old man? I'm not saying date him, I'm saying distract him. 
glory him, be with him. And I ask again, how possible is that? You know, just, it's very possible now, just for some time. Wait, let me get this straight. So, you want me to knock your old man? I didn't say that. <laughs> so how then will I date him without him touching me? You know, you get to that bridge, you cross it. You don't know have to handle it. Hmm. Babe, I'm serious, please. I'll think about it. Are you serious? No, I did not say I've accepted. I said I'll think about it. I'll pay you whatever amount you want. I'll pay you. I can even send you to M now. Two million. Big girl like you. <laughs> but you know money is not my problem, really. If you really would do it for me, whatever you want, I'll pay you because it's very frustrating, really. Hmm. Let's see how it goes. I need to call Gutsy now to tell you I've told you and you're saying you do it! I need to call Gutsy! Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Thank you all. This year, I must say, has been the most fruitful so far. It has been a great time of growth. All of you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You're carrying out your responsibilities so well. And I want to assure you in this new year, I do take note. I appreciate every one of you and I value you. Oh, thank, thank you. Thank you for your doggedness. Oh. <laughs> thank you, and I want to say, welcome to the new year with us. <laughs> thank you, sir. I also want to say that uh, some of you will be getting promotions uh, with great incentive. Mm -hmm. And this is to encourage your hard work and your continued support to the company. <laughs> yes, I would have loved to appreciate some individuals here for their exceptional um, uh, delivery. But I will not because of uh, some ethical reasons. But you will feel it in your envelope as you go home tonight. <laughs> Double yeah. chief. Double oh, chief. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I also want to see this opportunity to let every one of you know that uh, I will be relinquishing my office of the CEO in this new year. And every faithful staff, as I said earlier, will be rewarded. Hmm? Let's celebrate in this new year. Thank you. Mm, oh my dear. Oh yes, definitely. See, I was thinking of a little vacation. This is Austin from Hostier Logistics. Yes, yes, please. I'm calling to inquire about the movement scheduled this weekend. Oh, okay, okay. Um, I'll be expecting your call. All right, thank you. Thank you.
Hello, Secretary. Yes, um, is uh, Madam Kalista on seat? Oh, oh. Okay, um, that's fine. Please do let me know when she's in. All right, thank you. Thank you. <sighs> I hope this trip to Kutuno would give me an opportunity and a chance to be more closer to her. I hope. <sighs> oh, oh, yes, she is. Hi, Austin. Hello, good morning, Ma. What's my schedule for today? Um, you and I are supposed to go to the bank to pay in 15 million naira uh, for the clearance of the goods we're expecting this weekend. And? And uh, to visit uh, the director of Mega Deal Limited. Okay, so you're going to take care of these responsibilities today, okay? Uh, hope you're fine, Ma. I'm fine, I'm just not in the right frame of mind for meetings today. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, but you're coming to work today? Yes. Why? No, uh, nothing, nothing. I just thought to ask. Just get back to work and let me know how it goes. If you need my help, call me, okay? Okay, ma. Okay, ma. Imagine all my plans, all my strategy, all my, all my draft. Just, just scatter. If only I'd had the chance to go for this meeting with her, I would have made a mad impression, a mad first impression. Just imagine. One more. I need to strategize well. This trip to Kotono, more. I must, I must use it to, to, just lock it up once. Wait, oh. what? That's true, I have to remind her. Um, before she comes and bring one stupid mood swing excuse and just cancel our trip to Kutunu. Um, man, let me send that one soft reminder. Eh? Um, let's make this one count. Oh. I can't mess this one up. all the transaction made this week. To the goods. We have them land in Kotono this weekend. Yes, ma. And we also have to travel together our schedule. For this weekend, right? Yes, ma. Hmm. Austin, can we um, reschedule for next weekend? Sorry, ma. Can we make the trip for next weekend? Ma, no. You know, they are expecting us. And it's even safer for us to be there in person to receive these goods. Those agents, I don't, I don't, you can't trust them. In that case, me. I think you travel with Daniel. Inform him. What? I said you. Sorry. I said, I said you go with Daniel. Uh -huh. Ma, no. You know how the custom there, you know how they operate. It's very tight. Uh, me and Daniel cannot handle it. Okay, I'll make some calls and everything will go smoothly. Okay? Okay, ma. Would that be all? Yes, ma. You sure? Yes, ma. Enjoy the rest of the day. 
why do you like doing things with women? That I means she don't just throw all the plants for ground like caterpillar with cat. that woman he will tell me the house is going to bring her into yes she will come and meet me here and I will show him I will show him the stuff I made of Godson do not dare me I will take this anymore enough is enough no I have to do something My son, Kalista, my son is not going to marry you. No, he won't marry you at all. Excuse me, who are you and what do you want? <laughs> at last, at last, I meet you. You must be Kalista's father. Obviously, yes. Oh, I am Neka, Gossel's mother. Oh. In fact, I have been taking care of him since he was born. And a few minutes later, he lost his mom. And then, when he turned 10 years, his father passed on to glory. And now, I'm the one solely responsible for him. Okay, so madam, what is the problem? Yes, the problem is, how can you expect my son to come and live in your house? Just because you want to know if he's good enough for your daughter. Oh, that is unheard of. Uh, uh, li listen, madam. Your son was not forced into anything. I gave him my condition and he accepted. <laughs> he accepted, but I, his mom, rejected. He cannot take that condition because I am going to go with my son. Listen, he already accepted and we're just fine. Oh, by you, you are fine. But I, his mom, I'm not fine. So I'm going with my son. Oh, no. On a second thought. Oh, I had you a chief. Yes, I'm a double chief. <laughs> a double chief. Mm -hmm. You should understand tradition. Yes, I do. And when a man is married to a woman, what does he do? He stays in his own house. And not to come and patch with his in-laws, that is unacceptable. Well, in his own case, he's not even married to her. And you want him to come and live here? When the reverse is the case, no, it's unacceptable. Mm. Yes. Well, I said before, we are just fine. So, we don't have any problems. Okay, that's good. No problems. You can have him. Why? <laughs> I have your daughter. Yes, I'm going to go with her. In fact, what she will wear is not a problem. I have so much of her size that she can use. So, I'm going with her. Hey, 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 hey. stop right there. Stop where? Do not hurt no! my daughter. She is going with me. No. Daddy, no. Stop it. Who is this man?
how do I find out what is happening? Is this man what I, I, am I sure he doesn't have a negative plan? Hi. How do I find out if my brother's son is okay? And his wife and everything is okay. How do I find out? Ah. Hi. I have to pay them a surprise visit. I have to pay them a surprise visit. And maybe, paraventure, when I get there, I'll find him washing the cars or <laughs> cleaning the compound. Or maybe cooking. <laughs> then I will bring out that madness from him. I'll clean that madness out. Yes. That's what I will do. Let me go and get ready. I have to see the end of this madness. Yes. This woman. Hey, this woman. Which came out with this one? This is how you call it this early morning. Now your mama get to Mama, 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 yes. Now your mama get what? What do you find this anymore? Hey, I want to see my son. Now my kid can't find. You know the, in fact, nobody did. Ah, uh -uh. you sure? I, I, I be like move away. I say nobody there house. What about Kalisa? She not there. Ah, uh -uh. now she even first come up for this house. Now she first come up before your before your son and chief <laughs> come out. Ah, this time I love you this now. Hey, hey, your best, eh? I want to ask you something. I won't beg you for one small favor. No vex. Tell me this man, I just want to know for problem. Which problem you did talk of? I said I won't beg you for a small favor. And I go say to you, mm. I want you to make you to tell me what did they happen to my picking? How did they go? How did they come? Which kind of work did they give up? Whether did they tell me wash car or wash plates or clean house? I want to know. Hi. Yes. Kokoro. Hi. Not even look to forget. So wait, 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 wait. So, wait, you want to tell me to inform for my for my girls? I'm yeah, waiting for that. That's nothing now. Uh -uh. I just want to make you. They tell me when you give me information, I go give you. I go clean your hand for you. Uh, yes, yes <laughs> I go clean. Your... <laughs> hey, come, make I ask you something. Now, who they wash those cars? Yeah, okay, that one, I mean. Uh -huh. And they sweep it. Who they sweep the ground? Everything where they sweep. Both the one where your your son they drive, your dad they drive. I mean, they do everything, they go sleep, everything. So, my picking get moto. Hey! 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 Make you not tell anybody, say I come here. Eh? How do they tell anybody? Just, uh -huh. just so, I go. Ah, ah. I think say you know what's funny. Huh? It's always funny. This is right. I just call you. Huh? <laughs> you had somebody like that. Huh? Okay. Take this one. Uh, smooth, smooth. Now, come here. I did you now. Ah, come here. I did you. Take care, bro. Take care. Not tell anybody. Bye bye. Hey. 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 Hi, baby. How was your day? Oh, boy. Oh. Okay, how was your day? Fine. And yours? Good. Good. I spent my lunch break thinking about how lonely I feel, yet I have you around me. I know that feeling. Um, what's up with Jovita? Crazy girl gave me to this weekend. Hmm. 
I guess we can manage. Yeah, we can. We have to. I love you, baby. Love you too. <laughs> Alright, why don't we go freshen up and meet back here? Oh, you show sports? Yes, I don't want to violate the law. <laughs> you violated and you are gone. Yes, come in. Yes. Oh, my beautiful daughter. How uh, are you? Fine. Do I please need a favor? A favor? What kind of favor? Oh. So, remember my friend Jovita? Mm -hmm. She needs our help. Okay, what kind of help? Her landlord evicted her from the house because she couldn't afford her house rent. Oh. How much is the rent? No, it's not about the rent. I mean, she needs. I just want her to be here before, you know, pending the time she sorts herself out. Come on, my dear. Don't you think it's better for us to uh, get her a new apartment? No, it's not about that. So right now she's traumatized. So she needs to be around people she loves. Oh, okay. Mm, yeah. Uh, it's okay. But. Don't forget, you have your man in the house. So I don't want to hear uh, both of you fighting over who, who snatched who Oh, no. Jovita is not that kind of person. And God soon will never do a thing like that. Oh, really? Yes, Dad. Okay, she can come in. Thank you, Daddy. Okay. Thank you. Everything for you, my dear. Thank you. <laughs> what do you mean you're in Abuja? Tell me you're joking. Oh, you're supposed to move into my house tomorrow. Jovita, you're crazy, you know, right? I already told my dad that you'll be moving in with us tomorrow. But we already agreed, which one I would have called you first. Just try and take the first flight tomorrow, please. I'm not joking, it's not funny. Just, see, don't come up with an, another excuse, oh. What kind of nonsense is this now? Where is my son? I told you that he went out with my dad. So they are now close. My dad actually loves Gotten. That's their problem. So what can I offer you, ma? Nothing. Ma, so you're just going to sit down without like this without eating anything? Oh yes, I will. I'm not complaining. All I want is to see my son. That's all. I oh. want to ask you a question. Yes, ma. Have you ever been pregnant before? No, no, ma. Then why is your breast looking flat and your stomach having so much bummer inside? This is how my body is. Mm. If that's how your body is, then it's really bad. Ah, disgusting. You have to start working on yourself because uh, that could lead to you not having children. For my son and 
we need a lot of grandkids. I need a lot of grandkids and our lineage has to grow. Multiple kids. So you need, you need to do the need for and see what you can do to that stomach and that flappy breast of yours. Okay, ma. I'm waiting for my son. Okay, ma. Uh, where are you going? I want to get water to drink. Uh, yeah. You need it. Sir. Yes, sir. Yes. Let me have that. Um, no, he's actually running um, temperature. Then what he needs is drugs and not juice. Please call the doctor. Okay, okay. After I serve Give that to me. Let me serve him. Dad, it's not right for you to serve him now. Then you need a maid. Because I will not want you going into that room either. No? Let me have that. And Call the doctor, okay? Let me see how he's doing. That bad. As in, die, 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 die. Well, I'm here now. <laughs> Thank you. So, hi, is Daddy. Hi, is everyone. He's upstairs with God's in his room. Well, they are good then. You're just being an old jerk. <laughs> really? <laughs> 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 Okoro. Uh, Oga. Okoro. Chief. Uh, see, I, I need you to help me um, write vacancy for the position of um, house cleaner at the gate. Okay? Housekeeper. Yes, I need somebody who can cook and clean the house for me. Chief, Chief, now you're fine. Now, what are you here for now? Ah, chief, I'm not useless now. What do you mean you day here? Oh, chief, I feel warm. I swear, I feel warm. Okoro, that will be too much of task for you. You already have a job of a gatekeeper. Chief, Chief, you know too much. See, Chief, when I day abroad, this man tell you my story. Bless you, don't know. When I day abroad, I do five jobs. Five! She will not be seen on one mistake. Just make them just deport me. I just come back. I will still there. Ah, if I grow now, I will do one. Um, okay. Let me give you a try. <laughs> I'll, I'll give you a chance. <laughs> Chief. Thank you, sir. Chief, Chief. See me later. Chief. <laughs> Chief. I don't get work. Hi. Good job. Hi. Okoro. I say they receive blessing. Hey, uh, Mama. <laughs> Mama, I just be happy now, eh? <laughs> Mama, I get good news, oh. God don't do am. As I tell you now, I don't get another job. I to be somewhere they do. Hey. Eh, but Mama, eh? <laughs> you picking get one small challenge, oh. And now, <laughs> Mama, I don't know where I go finish me how to cook them. Oh God no. Beggary, something like that. Eh, eh, I, I won't make you help me. Eh, I, I, I'm not sabi. Hey, now, because now everything chief they like now. Now, why? Eh? Hi. Mama, wait, okay, wait, wait. Uh, this is our recent food that they cook like um, fried rice. You know sabi, am? Um, may teach me. Ha, Mama, you know you sabi fried rice. 
Okay, now no wala now. I go, I go, I go check, I go check the market. I go check, I go, I go go market, go buy. I no wala now. Go, go talk later, eh? Eh, yeah, mama. Yeah, bye bye. Mama, mama, you just have anything. The wrong person had the call. I'm glad everything was successful. Oh, thank you. Thank you. So you have all the receipts? Yes, my dear. Yeah, let me have them. Okay. All right. Yeah. Oh, my dad already signed. Yes, ma'am. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm sorry, ma'am. I... Can I have a minute of your time? Oh, sure. Why? Go ahead. Okay. I I got you something. I feel like it. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> what is this? A dress? You like it? Well, I love the color. <laughs> Thank you. All right. I'm glad you like it. Yeah, I mean, it's very thoughtful of you. Director to see you. Even Babala Ogo, they asked me why I didn't. Uh, Be this one, and I'm able to ask you waiting to leave for you. Where you call the go? I don't understand your second office. Are you not supposed to be at the gate? <laughs> See, you might tell you, but I say you don't know. Let me be the chief executive producer of the gate and to the kitchen. So, as, as I talk to you now, I won't cook. I beg on the go. And how is that one possible? Anyway, as far as I'm concerned, no one has ever said that to me. So, I will not allow you to cook anything. Oh, bless you, organ will tell you, say, you know, employ me. Oh, bless you, oh, they don't tell you. See, let me, as I, as I told you, I say, go they go now? Which come, go they go? The question is, go they go? My friend, go back to your duty post. See, now me they clean. Now me they sweep. Now me they wash. Now me they cook. Now me they open gates. See, as I, bless you, they don't tell you, now what they tell you now. So, as they be like this, now go they just pack your loan. As you take do, as you take come, just arrive, go back. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Okoro, did you drink anything? I put that drink. I put it somewhere. Cook. They tell me something. Come on, they go. They come for your bed. They go. They go. Ah. They go. Okoro, are you okay? So yeah. In my days, when I was younger, I hate bullying, strength, um, physical strength. Now, this friend of mine, he would always want to beat me up. And I hate to fight. He would knock me. I would start crying. 
But I knew the best fight was to fight with money. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, of course. So I got into business. I chased money. I was looking for money. Look at where we are today. And so you were using money to, uh, to be dating. Uh, but you know what? The ladies came after me. <laughs> they started coming after me. Well, we win some and uh, lose we lose some. <laughs> that is life for you. Uh, Jovita, I love the way you smile. <laughs> You're beautiful. Um, um, please, go to my room. There's a fire on top of the table. Bring it for me. That's something I want to show both of you. Okay, sir. <laughs> uh, she's such a beautiful, hardworking girl. Yeah, she is very hardworking, really. She is. Uh, on the second thought, uh, she may not see the fire. I think I put it inside the. Uh, and you drawer. always lock the drawer. Yeah. She, she, I don't uh, think let she me get it. it. She may not find it. Yeah, yeah, she may not be able uh, to locate it. I will be right back. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. <sighs> There you go. Thank you. <laughs> hey, Steve. Chivita is still in my father's room. Really? Yeah. But what would she still be doing there? I why? Don't why? Know. How no, am I, I just to... would like to know what. You would like to what? Wait, wait, let me just. You like to do what? I just want to go and check on it. Check? What? What's your business? Let me just. Uh... Maybe. You and your papa will now want to deal with hey, But let me just. I, I just want to stand by your door and, and do hear what. what I, 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 I just what? would like to know the hey? conversation and everything. You're too curious. Relax. Mm. 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 <laughs> what are you looking at? No. Relax. Jovita is doing her job. She was heavily paid for this, remember? I know, but what, what do you think they're talking about? Mm, she was talking about science. <laughs> <laughs> Talking about business. Obviously. <laughs> oh, <clears throat> oh, yeah. Could be also, uh, could be doing one or two. No, he's doing a good things. Man. Yeah? My dad is a good man. That man that has blood. <laughs> <laughs> that man will do and undo. <laughs> but yeah. I like the young man. And I want him to take over my company. Really? Mm. But I'm scared of the young boys of these days. Come on, Chief. Godson is a cool-headed young man, and he's committed as well. Yes. I saw some great potentials in him, and that's what triggered my decision. Hmm. Um, Chief, what about your son? Oh, Mark. <laughs> I've settled Mark. I weed everything in America to him. That's why I don't interfere with the affairs of the company over there. But everything here, belongs to my daughter, Kalista. Wow. Is she aware about this? No. I have not mentioned it to her yet. Hmm. Chief, you have a great plan. But I would suggest you let them get married as soon as possible. So that Godson can get acquainted with the company's affair before you fully retire. That will be soon. Very soon I will stop going to the office and uh, let him attend meetings on my behalf. I'm so happy for them. <laughs> uh, Jovita? Sir. Please, none of this word should get into their ears. I promise I will not. I will not let the cat out of the bag. <laughs> Very good. She's <laughs> now. You tell me you want to leave. Please, you can't leave now. The problem is that your father is not a woman kind of a man. And if I should keep doing all these things around him, he will start having a wrong impression about me. Then stop doing them. Then how will I now distract him without teasing and whining? Just do it like a daughter-father kind of relationship. <laughs> that one will not work, please. Moreover, have you asked yourself how this man will feel if he gets to find out about our plans? He won't find out. Or now you won't tell him. Ah, why will I do that? Uh -huh. So how will you find out? Just that. He wanted to come out and I keep holding him. One of these days, this man is going to suspect me. 
Stop holding him. Just all you need to do is give us signal and we'll code. After all, we're always here in the living room. Please now. No more. I didn't miss my house like this. But this is also your house. And I paid you heavily for ha. this job. Heavy. I, I don't hear now. <laughs> I just think I remind you. Hi. Good morning. Hello. Good morning. Uh, I'm here to see Chip. Oh, he's in the living room. Oh, okay. Yeah. Hello. Good morning. Morning. How are you? Uh, yeah. Um, Chief asked me to come with his documents. Yes, he mentioned about you guys having a meeting this morning. Uh, he's in the living room. All right. I'll take it in. See you in the office. See you later. This is good. First thing I must confess, this is good. You've done a good job. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much. And what other deeds do we have on ground? Um, Virginia Passage. They're bringing in the 10 containers um, Cottage Bull ordered three months ago. Mm. Okay, have you notified them about the arrival of the goods? Yes, sir, I've done that, but I would um, double check to be sure. Okay, um, when do we pay for that? Uh, I th this week, sir. This week. Okay. I'll make sure you sort it out with um, Kalista before the way runs out. Okay, sir. I'll okay. do that. I'll do that, sir. This is good. Thank you, sir. Uh, all right. Congrats. Thank you, sir. <laughs> uh, yeah. Um, um, just need some wine there. Yes, yes. How far now? Well, I just do. You don't go. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Uh, uh, I don't You know, say. I see. Hi, cross balls. Ah, you too much. Um, let's see <laughs> bro, what I can do. Say money. You know what? Just <laughs> keep everything. Everything, bros. Yes, yes. Hi. Oh no, <laughs> bros. Thank you. Uh, hey. Yeah. Um, I wanted to ask you something. Which me that? Uh, that man we follow Madame come out. Yeah. Who that man be? Ah, <laughs> bros, that guy bros. Now go ahead bros, you correct man. You ain't the thing they do me, now saying they do me. Hey! Go ahead bros. Who you come be to Madame? Eh, as I tell you, you see now Madame was meant to be. Eh. Yeah. Are you for real? Yes, now, uh, they don't tell you. Don't mind me. Yeah. Never mind, never mind. Uh, <laughs> I just want to ask. Eh, Alana. Yes. Bros, bros. Are you know drive inside? No, I packed. Okay, okay. Oh, yeah, now, bros. Let down now. It's bros. Ah! Ah! Hi! Sir, bless you. Just come meet me this morning. Eh? Hi! This morning now, I bless you. He goes, he goes, in fact, he goes, he goes, he goes, he goes, he goes, he goes, I don't go walk. I know. In fact, I go tell guys say hey, I don't retire. Ten years money, nine police. Tomorrow I don't pack my load. I don't resign. <laughs> It's better I start taking cuts from all of these deals and harness some money for myself. <sighs> just like that, one good digger just wants to come and take over as CEO. Ah, fuck off. So, this is where I will sit like this. Somebody from nowhere will just come and take over this company as CEO. Why you do? Why you do? You you slow die. Ah. Hmm. Anyway, I still have time. It's high time I start doing what I have to do. Let him let him take the woman. No, my lad. 
with me go with you. I'll start bagging some monies for myself. Yeah, I think that's better. That's better. Start changing figures. Start changing figures. The young man wowed everybody. Really? Yes. See, when I heard the remarks of his presentation, I was so proud of him. And I know he will handle the company so well. Wow. <laughs> Chief, I'm so happy for you. So you got another son back home? Yes. I am. Uh, since my son insists on not returning to Nigeria, I think it's better this way. <laughs> yeah. And God soon will be internally grateful to you. Mm. Um, Jovita, you will do something for me. What could that be? See, I want to throw a surprise engagement party for them. Wow! <laughs> Chief, how do you know I'm so good with that? <laughs> Why are you so excited? Why are you so happy about this? Because I can't wait to be the bright lady. <laughs> oh, young girls and party. <laughs> <laughs> so, where are we shopping? I hope it's going to be in abroad. Oh, come on. Don't be too excited so you don't let the cat out of the back unconsciously. No, Chief. Trust me. Cross my heart, okay. I will not. <laughs> <laughs> so, when will the engagement party take place? Um... Let's give it this week. Uh, we'll talk more about it next weekend. Next week? Mm -hmm. Wow, I was thinking it's going to be this weekend. Uh -uh. Slow down. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no problem. No problem. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, I don't like that one. Um, so what about this? No, check this. I like this one. No, this one, the arms, no, let me see. I, I like the upper part of this dress, but... But what? It's nice. It's no, really okay. I know it's... No, I want mine straight. I want my wedding dress to be really straight. And yeah, I don't I don't like this ball, whatever. Okay. Yeah, this one is too busy. I, I kind of like this one. Oh my God, look at the way <laughs> her skin is glowing. Oh, it's nice. Yeah. Let's go to the spa. It's been a while. Spa? Yeah. You need it. Right? Yes. A bride should be going by now. Right? <laughs> yes. Your uncle's wife. Yes, so. <laughs> Can we just go today? There's still time. Today? Mm-hmm. Mm -mm. Because Chief and I will be going out. So my dad, you're referring to like that. Ah. Uh <laughs> Ah, now you sabi oh. She, I warn you. You warn me. Don't go and kill my father before his time, oh. No, I will not. Who are you guys going to? Well... Don't ah, uh, tell me. Just show me. <laughs> Just for you, show me. I don't know. Okay, so what about this one? I don't like that. Nope. This one? Nope. You just don't like everything. I know how I want my wedding dress to be. I don't like that. Okay. Um, so what about this one? You just don't like everything. Ah. Hello, good morning, ma. What's the problem, ma? I'm so sorry, ma. I've been really busy with work. I'm sorry, ma. Please bear with me. I'll make out time to come see you. I'm, I'm, I'm so sorry, ma. I, I will come. Okay. Yeah. So, sorry. Yes, ma. I'll come. Uh, have a good day. Yes, ma. Man, I'm just so tired of everything. You just have to be patient. It's almost over. Over? <laughs> Look. I know you don't want to tell me the truth, but I feel like that man has other plans. Other plans? Why would you say that? He has someone else for his daughter. He's just making fun of me. <laughs> God sing. You don't have to say that. Why would you think that a man of his caliber would bring that himself to this if he has no good plans? The plan is to ridicule me. 
I should have known it all along. God saying, you have sugar at the tip of your lip. Please don't spit it out. All you need to do is to be patient. Okay? Too much money, problems have to spend it. Oh, Twenty dollar straight to Abu Kimiku start to the change it. Huh? I don't saw every day and night, money day. Oh my, mm -mm. now I don't harm. Papa God, don't bless me, and no one can change it. Oh, huh. Yeah, now this is how it's going to be. Henceforth. Uh -huh. I say, good day. I do one deal. I get monetary compensation. Nice. <laughs> I'm not going to lose anymore. And that's how it's going to be. Yeah. Woo! Back to work. Oh, you see her right? Ah, uh, Moni. Um, please, help me take a look at this. Uh, the file for me. What do you think about the transactions? There's a manipulation here. Yeah. I knew it. I knew it. And I told that Bofu that my son in law will fish it out. Yeah, no calculation was made. That's why the numbers are not adding up. Hmm. Yes, sir. Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> well, would that be all for now, sir? Yes, I will talk more about it when you return, okay? No problem. I have to work. Then go away. Kalisa? Yes, ma'am. Is that you? Yes, ma'am. Good morning. Good morning. How are you, my daughter? Thank you. Please have a seat. Ah, this one, you came this early. I hope everything is okay. Everything is fine, ma'am. Where's my son? Why is he not here with you? He went to work. I took the day off just to be with you. Just like that? Yes, ma'am. Wow. How are you doing, ma'am? I'm doing very well, as you can see. Okay. I hope you didn't do that just because of what I said the other time. I was only joking. No, ma. I actually wanted to come. Really? Yes, ma. I had it oh. to mind to come here. That is nice. <laughs> I brought this for you. Wow. Oh, thank you very much. Please take it to the kitchen. Okay, ma. Thank you. Thank ah, you. my wife, my <laughs> wife. Oh. My wife, come. Ma. <laughs> this is nice. Thank you, ma. But it's just a little mistake, too much salt. Oh. So next time you have to reduce the quantity. Okay, ma. Mm? Okay, ma. Mm. This one that I'm calling you my wife now, and your father has not given us a yes. <laughs> Am I safe? Ma? <laughs> Mm -hmm. He will come around, ma. Are you sure? Yes, ma. Okay. Hey, when he finishes with the training of my son, then you will come for your own. I will now train you and teach you how to cook very well. Hmm? Okay. To become a very good cook, okay? okay hmm? This is nice. Hmm? Yes, ma. That's good. All right? Yes, ma. Okay, then. Let so, finish. finish and go and have your food, okay? Okay, ma. Hi.
Darcy? Yes, sir. When will you be ready to take my daughter as your wife? Sir? What is confusing about the question? I am... Um... I found you worthy to be my son-in-law. So you have my permission to marry my daughter. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Gussie, do not fail me even in my death. Sir, I promise to love and take very good care of her. Good one. One more thing, Gussie. I want you to take over the position now of the CEO of my company. I know you will handle the office efficiently. Um, yes. Sir. You may have to start to write your resignation letter to the bank tonight because you will resume as soon as you turn not with my daughter. Sir. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Good evening, my adorable daughter. Hi, how are you? You are not looking cheerful. Anything the matter? I'm just exhausted. Oh, uh, then you will have to go freshen up because we have a lot to talk about. <laughs> hurry up, hurry up. saying and it keeps coming up with one stupid demand or the other. Wait, did you just call my dad stupid? Look, babe, I'm sorry. But you have to let him know that I'm not that type of guy. He has employees, he has you. Why me? You, you, you see, let me tell you something. You already know my dad. When his mind is made up about something, that is it. You know that already. You know what? He can give you to anyone. I don't care. Okay? Tomorrow he's going to come up with something else. Ah! So where are you going? I'm going to rest. My brain is stressed out. Oh my God, son. He's just unnecessarily angry. <laughs> Funny enough, your father likes his actions. It shows that he's not a good digger. Who cares? I like him. That's all that matters. <laughs> Baby, you should be grateful that you have a good man. If not, you know we're making this statement here. I know. I'm glad my dad loves him anyway. Wow. Your dad is a strategist. This was the plan all along. He only disgusted with that of his husband material. You know, my brother once told me that, oh, that my dad was going to hand over the company to my husband and not to me. So I have to marry a very good man. But you know, I never believed him. It's so fast. And even now that he's still active. I think you should go and talk some senses into him. I will. Let him rest a bit. Okay, since my work here is over, when am I going back to my house? Going back to each other. We have a wedding to plan. Oh, I almost forgot. So when are we starting? Go and ask Gotu. Oh, God are you team. kidding? God seen the runaway groom. Go Let me go and pick him. up my phone and call him. Look for him anyway, <laughs> anyway. Okay. <laughs> to reject it and I don't want to work in his company. People are going to think I married Callista because of our father's money. To hell with what people think or say. This is money we are talking about. We are rich. What? Oh, you want us to remain in poverty? Hey, bye-bye to poverty. Ah, wait. What are you dancing? 
Why would I dance? When we are already poverty is gone. Please sit ah, down. Please, ah, please. Ah, I have no. Please, hey. I say sit down. What are you saying? Ah, this is money, big money. Rejoice with me, my son. Poverty is gone. I, I thought you were against it. Mm. I was now that time that you went to stay in the house, and it's not in our uh, uh, custom and tradition for you to go and live with a woman. No, she has to come to you. That was why I was against it. Nothing more, nothing less. Wow. So mm. it's normal now? Yeah, it's normal now. Mm. Now that money is involved. Uh -uh. Who will see money and say no? Money versus love. Love versus money. That is what counts. You can't love without money. Eh? At least you have made me proud. I'm proud of you, son. You made a good choice. A very good choice. At least poverty is gone. I will have domestic workers walking all around, doing everything for me, ride the best car, and you, you ride the best car and live in a big mansion. What else do we want, son? And all my suffering for these years for you will not be in vain. Son, cheer up. <laughs> cheer up. It's God that gave us. We should rejoice. Hmm? Oh. You, you have the mind, the audacity to manipulate numbers and steal from me. After all the trust and all the opportunities I get to you. Chief, I'm sorry. Chief, I'm sorry. It's the devil's hand. Please, I'm sorry. Listen, you will be more sorry by now if not for my daughter that will be begging me on your behalf. Now listen carefully. You have five hours. Five hours to return to that office, pack every of your personal things and get out. I don't want to ever hear or see you around any of my properties. If not, you will force me to take action against you. Chief, please, I'm begging you. Please, Chief, I don't have anywhere to go to. Please. I have to get please, out of my Chief, house. Chief, Chief, see, I have not spent the money. I can, I can send it back to you, please, Chief. Please. Just, 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 just take the money and leave. Consider it as your pay. Yes. Can you leave? I have to get out of my house. Chief, please, I beg you. Please. Oh. Do you want me to involve the police and force you out of my house? Chief, please, I beg you. Please. Get out. Chief, please. Come on. Get going. Look at him. Thief! Can you imagine? Somebody who I trusted with everything. Going to the labor, labor market and look for another job. That's how you will learn how not to steal. So, Chief, in my place, when a young man finds a wife, he will come back to his family and inform them. And they, in turn, will go and carry out some investigation to find out if the narration is true. Okay, you're very correct. Um, he has my consent. Um, Gossin is a very good boy. Mm. I'm happy and proud of him. Yeah. <laughs> so, that's all. We have to, I have to go back and bring my people so we come with heart and call or not as tradition demands. Very nice. <laughs> and yes. where would that be? Um, that will be as soon as possible. I have to go and make some calls, you know, and uh, inform them, and then we do the needful. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, I will be waiting to hear from you. Okay. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Can't wait to have her as my daughter-in-law. She's so pretty. Ooh. And uh, thank you very much. <laughs> uh, 
Sit down now. Thank you, son. Oh, come on, my son. You're welcome. Thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> Your friend will leave me very soon, and I'll be left alone in this big house. Definitely, you'll be needing a maid. Yeah. You think what I need is a maid? Yes. A maid to clean up your house, cook for you, and then keep you company. Keep me company? And you think that should be a maid? Jovita, can you marry an old man like me? Me? Marry you? <laughs> Am I too old for you? Huh? Jovita, I've been thinking about this for a week now. I think I will find peace with you rather than bring in a stranger to the house. Chief, I am thirsty and... Jovita. Uh, please. I want you to think about it. I'm not in a hurry. Okay? And I can assure you a place in my ear and a good light before I shut my eyes. <laughs> Dad, so you're really sure about this? Yes. I want to marry Jovita, if that is your question. It's kind of weird. Listen, I really love her. I love her a lot. Yes. And I think the feeling is mutual. Does she know about this yet? <sighs> She's not finding it funny either. But I ask her to think about it. Whatever you decide, I will support you. Oh, thank you. Uh. This is not really what I want. But I've not been lucky with younger men. Maybe this is my destiny. I, I think I should excuse you guys. I'll marry you, Chief. You will? Yes. Uh, uh, look, Jovita, you, you don't have to be in a hurry. You can just take take your time and think about it. But why are you thinking about what I already know the answer? Are you serious? Yes. <laughs> you really sure? Yes. Wow, you know. I have just always been thinking of how of how my dad would cope when I get married. You know, at some point I was thinking of talking to Gutson about it, about my dad coming to spend some time with us or me coming here. I didn't think Gutson would accept that. So it's just been in my prayers for God to send an angel that will take care of my dad. And God indeed answered your prayers and sent an angel. <laughs> wow. Calista, so you set me up with God? It's the right thing to do. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. I want to be you. I know you are In spite of all that may be, I am giving up on no. Baby.
Just find love for some of us. Find joy and peace, which brings love into our hearts, and happiness, which brings so much love into our family. Whichever one, I found love and I am fulfilled. Baby, just give me your heart. 